Welcome back to the Loner Ranger Radio Show. Bruce Woodburn, Cross Country Mortgage, thank you so much for tuning in today. Um, when we left for the break, I promised you I was going to tell you what negative negative impact it could have if the federal government lowers the Fed rate. So I just want to recap the relationship between bonds and stocks. When the market's doing well, institutional money moves into stocks because they make them more money. When it's uncertain or volatile, they move into bonds because it's a safe haven. Now, we want the bond market to do well. We want it to go up, okay? We want interest rates to go down. So when the bonds go up, the yield is higher and interest rates come down. Interest rates on mortgages are not tied to prime rate. So I don't care what prime does. It makes no difference to me. We've seen the last three weeks, we've seen an improvement, a nice improvement, three quarters of a point in the rate improvement on interest rates. And that had nothing to do with the Fed not lowering the Fed rate because they didn't. And they said they weren't in September. Now they're kind of, you know, backtracking on that a little bit. But inflation is the arch enemy of the bond market. So inflation has killed it. Inflation is why you're paying more. Inflation's not going to go down. It's not going down. Your prices of your products aren't going down. When they tell you that inflation, they want it 2%, that means they want to get it down to 2%, but it's not going to go back to where it was. You're not going to pay less for eggs. You're not going to pay less for milk and you're not going to pay less for anything else you're shopping for. I mean, other than the normal price fluctuations that we might see, these prices are here to stay. So we're going to have to live with them. Okay. Now, why would I be skeptical or cautious of the Fed dropping the Fed rate? Well, you have to understand why would they drop the Fed rate? That is to stimulate the economy. By the way, if you have questions about this, call or text 407 250-9144-407-250-9144 or 813-213-4009 or webringyouhome.com. So the Fed lowers the Fed rate to stimulate the economy, right? So if it stimulates the economy, what do you think is going to happen to the stock market? It's going to rally again. People are going to invest. It's going to do well. So institutional money will move out of bonds and into stocks. Well, if they do that, it's going to tank the bond market and interest rates are going to go up. So when I tell somebody that interest rates could go up if the Fed drops the Fed rate, they look at me like I'm a nutcase. But what they don't understand is how the market really works. Now, if inflation is down, and the Fed drops the Fed rate, we should see an improvement in interest rates. I think inflation is flattened, but I don't think it's down. According to the numbers, it's still up just a little bit, but it's better than they wanted, okay? Or better than they, were, than they thought it might be. Let me put it that way. So I think that interest rates will trickle down on their own if we leave well enough alone. Now, I'm going to say this because it's, it tends to sound political, and I, I'm assuming it is, if Biden, or excuse me, if Harris gets in office, don't expect to see lower interest rates. It's not going to happen. They're tax and spend. So if you're a real estate agent, if you're a home buyer, if you're a home seller, you borrow money, you need a car, you need credit cards, then you would be a fool to vote for Harris. You'd be a fool. I'm just going to tell you that right now. It will make the economy worse. Their job is to slow us down. That's what the Democrats do. The Republicans want to build up self-employment. They want to ease out on, on, uh, on regulation. They want to open up drilling. They want us to be, you know, a free country and be able to supply all of our own energy. And these are the things that stimulate the economy that drive interest rates down. Isn't that what we all want? No, because the Democrats don't know that. They're not told that. They're lied to by their own constituents. They're told that you get all these free money and we're going to cancel your student loans and pay for your cell phone or do all kinds of things, but they don't do it because they don't have the authority to do it. So why? Why? So you be careful as to who you vote for because it will impact your retirement because if Trump gets in, your 401k and your retirement's going to rally. If by, if, if Harris gets in there, I don't think we're going to see much of an improvement on it. I really don't. 
Now, we had a pretty good couple of years in the stock market while Biden was in there. But most of that was because of all the things that Trump had did, be, did before he left. Now, it remains to be seen. So the future is in your hands. Vote very carefully because it will make a difference. And I don't care if you like Trump or not, but I guarantee you, you won't be in war. Nobody's going to mess with us. Ukraine will be safer. Israel will be much safer. We don't have to worry about Iran because they're not going to screw around with us. They'll screw around with Israel, but not with us. So vote carefully. Your future depends on it. That's all I got to say about that. And I think that the real estate market will come back. And at the end of the day, everyone's paycheck revolves around the real estate industry globally, globally, not just yours. So you look at when real estate is doing well, everybody makes money. When real estate is doing poorly, not as many people make any money. Look at your paycheck. Look at what's happened since Biden's been in office. The market's been crap. It's been crap. We've had high inflation. We've had the housing prices continue to go up, but so did interest rates. So what, what do you think is going to happen if we get four more years of that? I think we're in trouble. I think we could end up in a depression. Forget a recession. I'll take a recession even over inflation but I don't want a depression. Then nobody's has work. Everybody's uh, all your 401k is going to go to hell in a handbasket. It'll just disappear. And then we're all in for a, a big problem. So that's what you're going to get. If you vote for Harris, look at your future going downhill. That's the way I figure it. 407-250-9144 or 813-213-4009. My name's Bruce Woodburn. I'm the Lone Arranger. So interest rates, according to bankrate.com, are 6.57%. Now, I'm going to tell you something that is about the average interest rate. However, I have seen clients and I have locked clients in in the fives just in the last two weeks and in the sevens. So you're somewhere in between there. You got great credit. Now's a good time to buy. Sellers are starting to get less motivated to make repairs. I had a big deal fell apart just this weekend. Seller wouldn't make repairs. And the buyer's like, man, this is a buyer's market. It's turning. Why? Because interest rates are dropping. So more buyers are getting in. Sellers are less, less willing to pay closing costs, less willing to make repairs. So I've been telling you folks this for the last Two years since since March of 2022. I've been telling you that this is a buying opportunity. Forget the rates. We can always refi later or we can do a buy down. So don't sit around and wait because your opportunity is going to shrink. Now, if you've got 20, 30 percent to put down on a new home, you're going to be fine. But if you are one of those people that have less than 10 percent to put down on a home. You are going to be shoved out of the market as interest rates continue to drop. So why would you want to do that? Do you, don't you want seller to pay your closing costs? Don't you want the seller to fix the roof? Don't you want the seller to fix the electrical? Don't you want the seller to fix the plumbing problem? They're not going to do it when you got 15 people knocking your door down the day you put your house on the market. And that's going to happen as interest rates continue to, to drop. My new origination has literally doubled in the last three weeks, doubled my calls. I mean, we're all working overtime over here. We're all working overtime. So you can call me right now. I'll work overtime for you. 407-250-9144 or webringyouhome.com or 813-213-4009. I want to give a shout out to Trinity Family Builders. If you're looking for a great home in Groveland, Mineola, Claremont, Leesburg, beautiful communities running from about 380 up to about 700. They'll pay your closing costs when you use a loan arranger. Tell them the loan arranger sent you. They've got communities out in uh, St. Cloud as well. Then if you're looking down, I've been spending a lot of time down in Bartow, Frostproof, Lake Wales, uh, Lake Helen, um, Lakeland, 
Uh, I'm working with Southern Homes down there. Great builder, Southern Homes. They'll build on your own lot or they have spec homes. They got multiple subdivisions. Uh, we're doing construction perm loans for them. Uh, and we're doing regular end loans for them. They'll pay all your closing costs up to 6%. All your closing costs up to 6%. They'll do rate buy downs. I mean, you can't go wrong. I, they got homes starting in the high 200s there in a 55 and up community. And then even in your regular communities, they're in the low 300s to high 300s. So it's just, they're a, an affordable builder that pays your closing costs. So, and you know what I love about that? I feel like I'm kind of out in the country in Georgia because there's a lot of space out there. Bartow, phenomenal area. You know, bar, me growing up here, Bartow was this cowpoke country. Now, and I'm a cowboy, so I like that. But, you know, now it's starting to grow a little bit more, but it's still far from being a big city. So if you're interested in uh, Trinity Family Builders or uh, Southern Homes, give me a call at 407 250-9144 or 813-213-4009. My name is Bruce Woodburn. I'm the Lone Arranger. I'm here to give you all the information that you could possibly want. Uh, again, uh, I'll be at the K92-3 All-Star Jam tomorrow night. Uh, I might have a ticket or so available. So if you, you would like one or two, just call or text me. I'll see if I got one left for you, but, uh, I'd love to have you join us, um, uh, and watch some great bands, Jordan Davis, Carly Pierce, Lee Bryce, Corey Kent, Tucker Wetmore, uh, and several more great stars. This is where I met Taylor Swift. This is where I met Blake Shelton, Jason Aldean, Aldean, Luke Combs, Luke Bryan, Sarah Evans, uh, Cheryl Crow, you name it, man. I have met and hung out with a bunch of these stars and this is the event. This event brings on all the up and local comers. So call me, text me if you'd like to go. So um, now I want to get into Hometown Heroes has about 16, 17 million left. I'm going to give you a week and a half left, maybe two weeks for Hometown Heroes. So if you want down payment assistance, I can get you up to $35,000. Okay. You have to make less than $132,000 a year. You have to be a first time home buyer and you have to have at least a 640 credit score. How would you like that? But you better hurry because this won't last. And I'm hearing people go, oh, they're going to renew it. Not for a year. Not for a year. So you'll be out renting again for another year. So if you're pain, painfully paying rent and you want to get out of it, I can help you. I will help you with your credit repair. Don't do it yourself and don't hire anybody. Okay? That's the, that's the deal. Don't do it yourself and don't hire anybody. You call me. You call me. I will fix it for you. At least I will tell you what to do to fix it. I do it every day. And boy, boy, you will screw it up worse by you doing what you do than you will be if you take my advice. Okay. Um, I want to talk a little bit also about um, Mardon Construction down in South Florida. If you're down in Punta Gorda area, Charlotte County, you want to build on your own lot or you'd like Mardon Construction to build a home, they got homes in the low 300s to the high 300s. Beautiful homes, brand new construction. You can build on your own lot, or they've got lots they'll build on for you. When we do have about 37 specs, and they will also pay your closing costs. So there's another great builder. Now, I want to, uh, I got about a minute left here. So all I want to do right now is I want to tell you that if you are considering buying or selling a home right now, now is an optimum time to do it. The market is ripe. It's a good time. Buyers especially. Now, I always advise that you get closing costs paid rather than negotiate off the price of the house. Why? Because closing costs are dollar for dollar out of your pocket. That's why I always negotiate closing costs. You want somebody that's going to fight for you? Call the loan arranger. You can call me now at 407-250-9144 or 813-213-4009. Uh, or webringyouhome.com. If you like to talk to Cleve Loveland, Cleve Loveland can be reached at 407 407- 352-8118, 407-352-8118. He'll be here in just a minute. So uh, we'll be able to talk to him. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back in five minutes with more of the Lone Ranger Radio Show.